Welcome to Scale It Weight, how to create a report. In this video we'll show you how to create a report for your information, just to keep track of what you've weighed in and out in the software. We'll click the Create a Report icon on the Welcomes page and perform action. The first thing you'll want to do is select the date range of the report you want to generate. For this one I'm going to go back a little ways, we'll say from January 1st to today, so everything for this year. Then we'll want to select the type of report we want to create. You'll see a bunch of reports populated in here that are come default with the software. We'll select the one for grouping the wanes on the client. And once that's ready, we'll click Show. You'll see our report for wanes grouped on client is generated, and it will give us every wane we've done from January 1st to today. Now let's go back up here and select a different report. We're going to select the Wayne's grouped on product. This will give us a report of every Wayne we've done grouped together by the product. We'll click show and you'll see the report we get for every Wayne from January 1st to today. Broken down by which product it is and their totals. One thing to note is all the information you see on this report is completely customizable. Uh, if you go to the advanced section and then report designer or new report, it will bring up the, uh, it will give you the ability to create your own report or edit any report you're working with. You also have a filter option. This will allow you to add or remove any filters you see on the report. It will give you the ability to break down a report by vehicle or by project or whatever user created it. So let's say we wanted to create a report uh, that's grouped by, pro by products but you want it to be for a specific vehicle. So we'll go to the filter and we'll make sure the vehicle filter is visible by just check clicking it. You'll see the vehicle filter is now added into the filter list. We'll then double click in the yellow section and that will bring up our vehicle list to select from. Select the vehicle you wish to filter. We're going to do vehicle number one. So we'll double click on that vehicle. And you'll see now that the filter is saying vehicle number one. From there, make sure that's all the filters you want to add. For this example, that, that'll do it. So this is going to give us a, what, uh, every way we've done from January 1st, grouped on the product by this vehicle. We'll click show and that will generate this report for us. Here you'll see we've done four wanes with, for product number one with vehicle number one. Then if you want to ever clear the filter, there's a button to clear out all filters and then you can click show and you'll see we're back to the original report. From here you'll have the option to print the report, save it in pretty much any format available, and you can also directly email this report if you wish. Once you're done and you have your report saved or printed, go in and click close and that will exit out of the report section. You can also access the reports from the main window, reports button. By clicking this, it will bring up to your report designer. That is how you create a report in Scale It Weight software.